this is the corresponding frequency table. Value 2 appears 3 times, in the uh, distribution value 5 appears 2 times and value 7 appear, appears 5 times. The sum of all frequencies in this second column is equal n, so the sum of all frequency, a very complicated formula, is actually n. And this is the trick to everything that I will show you in this tutorial. Average, if you remember, and of course you remember, is the sum of all values divided by the total number of cases, or the sum of all frequencies in our case. Now, 2 appears twice, uh, 3 times, 5 appears twice, and 7 appears 5 times. So we can use multiplication of x and f of x. And the same formula is becoming very simple formula of the product of x and f of x. 2 times 3 five plus 5 times 2 plus 7 times 5. Although the formula for average from frequency table looks very scary, I will show you that it is actually quite simple. So, let's first calculate the product of each value times the frequency. And you know that we will use copy and paste this formula to calculate all products, which is the numerator. Then, I need for this formula the sum of all frequencies. So, the sum of all frequencies is this, which gives me how many cases I have. 22 cases. And I need the sum of all products of the value and the frequency. And it is 144. So, the average according to this formula will be this sum divided by the sum of all frequencies. OK. Here on the top, I uh, put the interval in which my data is recorded, my original data. So let's check this formula. Equals average directly from the B4 to B27. This, these are the cells in which my data is recorded. If this formula is correct, and of course it is correct, you can see that we can calculate average in different ways, but this formula in which we multiply each value of x with the frequency and then divide by the total number of frequency is very um, close to uh, probabilities because every frequency divided by the sum of the frequencies is actually the probability of our random variable. So this formula is important for the future calculations and models.